Then we'll move on to the next question, which is about street-based developments, and it's in the hands of Assemblymember Boff. Uh, yes, Andrew, I'm, I am in favour of, of street-based developments where, where possible, um, though I think, as, we, as, as you and I discussed the other day, there are some interesting problems raised sometimes by uh, street-based development, but generally you can achieve wonderful things. If you look at what we're doing in the Olympic Park area, there will be uh, it will look like the best of London, uh, uh, terraces, uh, squares, uh, in, a, in the new London vernacular, I think will, it will look fantastic. Um, yes, obviously, well, you know my view on the Olympic Park, that it will actually contain the be best and the worst of well, design. Well, uh, I, 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 I appreciate and, that. Um, but, but, but that, I suppose, uh, uh, you're, well, you're acquainted with my view on that. Um, there, there are some requirements in the London Plan that actually make it quite difficult to provide street-based developments. Would you support a review of uh, the London Plan to see what gets in the way of providing street-based developments? Uh, yes. I mean, the, it, yes. It's one of the things I think people need to focus on here That's is yes. uh, that we do, we do want street-based. It would be wonderful to have uh, a return to the Georgian terraces with even five, six-storey uh, uh, structures such as you find in Pimlico, perhaps even seven uh, stories. One of the difficulties, of course, is that within the London Plan, there's a stipulation that any building above three stories must have a lift. Now, we could take that out and say that you know you, it, you didn't have to have a lift until you were at five, six, seven, eight, nine stories. The, the trouble is that uh, I think you know we've got to the, the stage now where people would find that suddenly a uh, restriction on the accessibility of the building. And people would say, are you really seriously taking, going to take lifts away uh, when uh, we have so many elderly people, so many uh, disabled, and so on and so forth? So I, I think the, the walk-ups, which are um, uh, so attractive, uh, are, are, are limited in their, in their, um, in their flexibility. And that is, that is one of the problems that, that, that we face. And if you, if you put in a lift for a building of sort of six, you know, four, five, six stories, people will say, well, why? You know, why you know, what's the, what's the, the, the economics of it won't, won't add up. You'll be spending an awful lot on the core and on the shaft uh, of, the, of the lift uh, and, and not actually maximizing the uh, potential habitation in the, in the building. So there, there, there is a... The, 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 the create streets agenda is slightly in conflict with the, uh, the general uh, acceptance now of the need to provide disabled access and access for the elderly and indeed for, for buggies and all, all the rest of it. Thank you. I mean, that was a good summary of, uh, in general, why sometimes a street-based development may not be suitable. Um, Let's talk about specifics. Would you be supportive of developers having to provide an excuse in their ap a reason in their application why a, um, a street-based development is not possible in that particular instance? Yes, I think that's. I mean, I think yes, that, it, that's another. That, yes. That's the sort. I mean, it, 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 what they what they tend to, to do is is to explain why uh, the 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 p -tail ratio or whatever it happens to be in, in necessitates a certain. A certain approach. Um, you've been so much more cooperative than even I imagined you were going to be. No, I'm a huge uh, fan just, of just for the record, Chair. Um, we've look, now got no, two I, well, yeses. I, I, I thank you. I thank you for your continuing. You know, uh, when I look around, the things that are being built now, I think a lot of them look absolutely fantastic. I, I really do. I know this is not a, not everybody. Agree. I think I think if you there is a huge there's a growing use of brick in a, a beautiful way. People are using brick. There's the, the, the style of, of, of built. It's 21st century. It's not, we're not trying to redo Georgian terraces again, but they, they have something of that spirit. Yeah. And I think the designs that people are coming up with, the sort of organically, people have settled on a new London vernacular. And it's something that I think we should support and perhaps we should give some extra push behind. Thank you, Mr. Mayor, and I invite you, therefore, I think you've been, actually, to come down to Galleons Drive in, um, on Barking Riverside and look at the sweep of the terraced houses there, and it looks like a new bath with, with, without trying to yeah. pretend to be bath, if you know what I mean, and uh, very high-quality developments, and I do invite you to come down.
Chelsea Barracks won't be quite the same. But it'll be streets and squares. Right. Thank you very much. Fantastic. Hurry there. I will move on to the next question.